Hey, you're feeling like the big boy. He was 16 pounds when I got him. And I don't know if he thought he was a dog, but he didn't think he was a horse. No, if you think you're living in the bedroom, you can forget it. I would come in and he had gone in my purse. What are you doing in mommy's purse? You come over here and say sorry right now. He would try to bite the dogs on the rear end as they went by. And he would always try to eat the paperwork. He stopped eating my paper. But in such a cute way, you could never get mad at him. When I picked him up, Peabody was three days old. And his mother had rejected him because he was so small. I got a call from a lady who has a breeding ranch. She said, my mayor just had a baby and it's a dwarf, so we're gonna put him down. He couldn't walk because his legs were crooked and his bite was off. I said, no, don't do that. I drove across country and I went and got Peabody. And he looked at me and he thought, did I die and go to heaven? <laughs> I started feeding him the milk out of a bowl because he couldn't seem to latch on with his jaw. It was so difficult. And then I had some shoes made for him. The next thing you know, he's running down the wood floor, making all kinds of noise. Unfortunately, he was too small for the other horses. If you walked by him and brushed him, he'd fall over. Oh, oops, oh, you okay, sweetie? So he became our house horse. My husband would come home and we would have dinner. And Peabody was right there too, looking up at you begging for a scrap. I had two French bulldogs. And one day, here comes Penelope. She went up nose to nose. He had no fear whatsoever. They'd run and see who would win the race. Oh my gosh. And Peabody would run as fast as he could. The Frenchies, they would bang into each other, but not with Peabody because they knew he wasn't strong. And yes, he was a dwarf, but he was going to be a stallion. Unfortunately, because they're compromised with their health, Dwarf horses don't have a long life. And so little Peabody passed away. But his spirit is going to live on. He was really part of the family. It's time to watch more.